Okay. I'm gonna let y'all know right now. If they piss me off in this episode, <laughs> I'm gonna play until stinking ass that we was fired. <sighs> Hopefully they don't piss me off because I don't got time for this shit. I'm on my way. Winky face. Fucking stupid ass bitch. I can do this. He's my boyfriend. I like him. It's not like I'm a virgin anyway. A little later. You wanted to see me? I don't like to be alone here. And I wanted to see you. What? And I'm sorry about the other night. But I think I'm ready now. The what are we still doing here? Stupid ass. He took my hand. We made our way to my bedroom. He started to kiss me as he was waiting for this moment for ages. He started to undress me. Everything was happening so fast. In no time I was in my underwear in front of him. He pushed me on the bed and came on top of me. He grabbed my wrist and kissed me hard. I wasn't, I wasn't feeling comfortable at all. Each of his touches reminded me of John. Uh, I started to cry. I wanted to stop. Please stop. Mm, what? Come on, not again. He continued to kiss me. His hands were all, were um still on my waist. I couldn't get away from him. Steve, please. This is going too fast. Are you kidding me? You're the one who asked me to come here. And now I'm here. And I didn't come for nothing. He didn't want me to. He didn't want to let me go. I was trapped. Leave me alone. You're my girlfriend. And that's what a girlfriend does. What? Now give me what I want. My heart was beating faster and faster. He's the same mus- monster than Tyler. As Tyler, bitch. I need him in the nuts and I pushed him on the floor. I stood up. My body was shaking with fear. He stood up and stared at me. Do you think... Wait, do you think you can make me... Make a fool of me? Wait, do you think you can make a fool of me? He raised his hand and he slapped me hard in the face. You and me, it's over. Bitch, call Liam, bitch. Cause you know, thank you. I'm glad you got your ass slapped up. Yeah. Call Liam. This is all my fault. I'm so stupid. No one will ever love me. I stayed in my bedroom, crying all the tears I had. Who am I kidding? The only one I want is Liam, right? But will I ever be able to give him what he wants anyway? Um, He was pretty clear. He doesn't want anything but sex. I will never date anyone again. I don't even know why I changed my mind. It was the plan since the beginning. Why did I fall in love with Liam? Why? I knew it was wrong. I knew it was impossible. And now look, and now look at me. I was about to have sex with someone I didn't even love just because I was mad and lonely. What what did I think? <sighs> that I could replace my feelings for Liam? I'm stupid. Yeah, girl. I barely slept that night good. I woke up with puppy red eyes and with a bruise on my cheekbone. Why you always go into this fucking sweatpants mood? Bitch. What's going on? Why is this bitch kissing your boyfriend? Because we're not together anymore. Why? What happened? Tell her, bitch. Because I didn't want to sleep with him. And I thought I was ready, but I'm not. So he dumped me. I didn't want to tell her the whole truth. Bitch, please. I'm so sick of always being the victim. My life is never going to get it better anyway. He's a jerk. He doesn't deserve you. Anyways, it's in the past now. What's on your face? It's nothing. Did he hit you? I said it's nothing. Hours passed. I wasn't in a good mood. I didn't talk a lot. Bitch, did you... Girl, as you... Your friend ain't your friend, girl. Because your friend should have went to your old man. Your old friend, Liam. Crazy bitch. And told him, bitch. I think that nigga slapped her ass up. 
Ugh. And after school, I went home. Joanne wasn't there today. I'm used, uh, I used to go to her place after school, but I wasn't in the mood anyway. What's bothering you? I think Stevie hit Blake. What? That's insane. Why would he do that? I don't know. All I know is that he dumped her and today she has a bruise on her face. You're thinking too much. She probably fell or something. I know her. Something is wrong. She told me he rushed her to have sex just yesterday. He's Tyler's friend. What if he's the same? What if something wrong happened last night? Oh, he gonna march his ass over there. Where are you going? Tom came between uh, Clara and Stevie and pushed him. What did you do to Blake? Blake and I are over. That's why you hit her? She got me, she got me hot, and then she rejected me. And it was just a slap, technically. I, uh, I didn't hit her. Mm. Bitch. Whoa, bitch. Son of a bitch. So where is he going exactly? Yeah, you read the crap out of this jerk. <laughs> Tom, wait for me. <laughs> right. Shit, you better run your little ass off. Where the hell is Tom going? Is Tom going to get Blake or something? I don't understand. I went home. I had dinner alone. I went to my bedroom. I did my homework. I was about to go to sleep and I heard a noise. Mm -mm. Oh, bitch. I'm back. Oh, bitch. I don't got the time, girl. The next day. What happened yesterday? Why did Tom hit... Oh, why did Tom hit Stevie? He did what? <laughs> Everyone's talking about that. Apparently, he beat the crap out of him. I don't know what happened. I wasn't there. But Stevie and I aren't together anymore. He's with Clara now. What? Why? I don't want to talk about that. Hell yeah. Ask her what happened. Can you tell me what happened yesterday? Blake, you know you can tell me anything. I'm not stupid. I knew something was wrong. Tom helped me. Just helped me to know the truth. He said he... Stevie said he slapped you. Tom went crazy and punched him. He totally deserved this. But you should have told us the truth. We're here for you, Blake. If you have any problems, you can count on us. Even Tom, he really liked you. Thank you. That's very sweet. But he didn't have to do this. I can defend myself. I know, but we care about you. Class pass. Liam wasn't there and I still couldn't stop thinking about him. This is driving me crazy. Each day it breaks my heart more and more. Bitch, go and pull up on that nigga, girl. Shit. Wanna go to my place? Yeah, why not? I wanna go anywhere else other than my home. Mm -hmm. Don't say to Aldo that you're single. He has a thing for you. Aldo? No fucking way, girl. There's no way I date Aldo one day. Even if he was the last man on earth. <laughs> God damn. Anyway, the boys are waiting for us. But if you don't mind, I have to see Vince first. Just follow me. How can she like this man? <laughs> Girl, you say that every time. God knows that the horrible things that he does every day. Girl, what kind of things he forced them to do? Do you like this place, Blake? You know you can pay uh, me rent too if you want. No thanks. Blake's a good girl. You're wasting your time, Vince. Good, good and bad are subjective things. Oh shit! What the fuck? Suddenly I heard a gunshots. What the fuck? Pop up men are here. Go to your trailer and lock the door. Find them. And meanwhile, Liam. Oh, I thought the Liam's ass was going to be on the corner. Liam. <laughs> 
where the hell are you? Pablo's men are here and they're killing, they're on a killing spree. I'm on my way. Who the hell is it? Who the hell is that? Who are you and what are you doing here? Garbage like you should die. What? Who sent you here? You killed my son. What are you talking about? My son overdosed. He's dead. And I know <laughs> I know you are the little crap who sold him this shit. Bitch, your meanwhile, get your get your ass up out my motherfucking house, bitch. Your son bought the shit, huh? We're gonna die. <laughs> We're safe here. Are you sure about that? I guess. Oh god. Everything's gonna be fine. We just have to wait here. I was so scared. I'm gonna die. If they come here, they'll kill us for sure. Let's talk. Talk? <laughs> do you think it's the best <laughs> thing to do right now? <laughs> do you prefer to listen to those gunshots? She's right. There's nothing we can do. We're stuck here. I'm gonna die here. Oh, girl. What the fuck? Y'all shooting up some shit, bitch. <sighs> this is, is this the first time they come here? Some guys already came here, but they didn't, uh, left alive. They didn't leave alive, girl. But this time, they're, they are, there are many. But Vince's men are here, too, so we don't have to worry, I guess. Why are you living here? Where are your parents? This is personal. Come on, don't you trust me? We're gonna die anyway. <laughs> I'm an orphan. I lived in a foster family, but they didn't treat me well. They hit me. I left them when I was 14. I took a train and left town. I came here. I lived in the streets. I stole people. I stole from people to survive. One day I met Vince. He helped me and we. he welcomed me here. He found a new identity for us. Um, They never could find me. I'm so sorry, John. I don't need your pity. I don't pity you, I understand. I know. But I don't like to talk about that. This is the only one who knows my story. So what's the deal? What are you talking about? I guess you're doing things for him. You skip school. You're often outside, just like Liam used to do. So what are you doing? I steal. I meet rich guys. I date them and I steal their wallet. I pretend to go to the bathroom and then I disappear. Um, I'm doing what it takes to survive. I know. I'll never judge you. I just want to know. Well, I just want you to know better. I just want to know you better. You're my friend. I'm like, what the fuck? Um, and I'm glad I found you. Me too. Oh, girl. Enough about me. Tell me about you. Uh, what do you, what do you want to know? You already know everything. How about why Stevie broke up with you? Girl, she don't know everything. Because I didn't want to have sex with him, so he broke up with me. It's not nice of him, but come on, sex is not a bad thing. Why didn't you want to do it? Are you still a virgin? You can tell me. I just told you my life story. Right? No, I'm not. What's the problem? Didn't you enjoy it? Did he have a small penis? Uh-oh. What's going on? Oh, Jesus. Like, what's the problem? I'm keeping this secret uh, for so long now. I'm so tired of this. It kills me more and more every day. Today, I'm going to die anyway. Right? Just tell her because you ain't going to die. I, I was raped. My stepfather rapes me. What? No. I'm so sorry. Did you tell anyone? No, my stepfather is rich and powerful. He'll never go to jail. And my mother didn't believe me when I told her. He can't get away with this. It's okay. I, I'm used to it. One day I'll leave this hell. And I'll be stronger than ever. Oh, bitch. If, well, so I'm the only one who knows? Yes. You have to promise me that you'll never tell anyone. Blake promised me I trusted you by telling you this but you have to respect my wishes don't tell anyone especially Liam he must never know under any circumstances 
promise you, I promise. But if Liam knows that I kept this from him, he'll never forgive me. He'll never know. And he doesn't care about me. I think you're wrong about that. Actually, I think he cares more than you now. I think he loves you. He's just too stubborn to admit it. He played me like all. Oh, like that's all. Wait, he told you played me. That's all. He wanted sex. And obviously I can't give him that. There's more than that, Blake. I saw the way he looked at you. Great. Now you read people's eyes. <laughs> There's something I have to tell you. We have to promise I won't, you won't get mad. Okay, I promise. I promise. <laughs> Fine, I promise. What is it? <sighs> when Tyler kidnapped you, we didn't exactly tell you the whole truth. That night Liam found you. What? <laughs> he called. We called him in. He found Tyler. He beat him. That's why no one saw him since. Because he's in the hospital. Why did you lie? Liam asked me to lie. He thought you were happy with Stevie and I thought the same. He said he didn't want to ruin your happiness. So I was right. I hurt Liam and you lied to me. Blake, I'm sorry. I can't believe this. All of you are playing with my life and my feelings. You don't understand. I thought you didn't love him anymore. I thought you were happy with Stevie. I wanted to protect you. But I guess I was wrong. But now I know that Liam loves you and... And that you still love him. You should talk to him. Yeah, trust me, I will. I almost slept with Stevie because of him. Because I thought he saved me. I'm so sorry, Blake. Oh, what the fuck? The area is clear. You're safe. Thank you. Is Liam here? No, he didn't show up. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll find him. Sure will. Going to that bitch house, Blake. <laughs> I'm sorry. I ran and ran. I was so upset. I just, I guess I was still afraid of what just happened. Everyone lied to me. They made a fool of me. I'm going to find Liam and give him a piece of my mind. I arrived in front of his house. His car was there. I knocked on the door. He didn't answer. But I know he was there. I opened the door and I walked in. I know you're here. Oh. And then I saw the worst thing of my life. Liam was lying on the floor. He was hurt. There was blood everywhere. Liam. Aww. Liam, can you hear me? He was shot in the abdomen. Abdomen. He lost a lot of blood. His pulse was weak and his body was cold. Aww, that's full. I called an ambulance. I was so afraid of losing him. They're coming. Please stay with me, Liam. I'm so sorry. You're everything I have. Please don't leave me. I put my hands on his wound. He was bleeding way too much. Don't leave me. I can't leave. Well, you can't leave me. I love you. Aww. Suddenly, he put his hand on my hand and held it. You can hear me? Wait, can you hear me? I'm sorry. I. Liam, can you hear me? <laughs> Please stay with me. Don't die. I felt him go. let go of my hand. No, 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 no. I don't fucking know. Stay with me. I forbid you to die. Do you hear me? <laughs> I don't want to live without you. I can't. Oh, y'all. This is sad. To be continued. This is sad. Oh, oh my God, you guys. Okay, let's go to the next one.